Hello everyone, Alex here, creator of the Crogth app and welcome to today's video. So, you've just done a workout and now you're here for your full body cool down exercises to do after your workout. Let's take it into a five minute flow through 10 exercises of 30 seconds each. Are you ready? Let's get started. In reaching up and folding down, reaching the floor, bending the knees and then reaching up. Take nice deep breaths to recover from your body, moving through, reaching up and folding down. Keep going through these two positions. Okay, let's reach over both sides. Take one hand and hold on to the opposite wrist and reach over, stretching the sides. So the next five minutes is gonna be all about bringing the heart rate down, circulating the blood through your body and getting a good stretch to help your recovery and start that cool down through the body. Let's take it into a torso twist but now let your arms be really relaxed. Twist your hips from side to side and just have lazy arms. Just let them hang and slap from side to side. Bend the knees. Whatever workout you just did, now's the time to feel awesome. Congratulate yourself. Pat yourself on the back. Okay, interlock your fingers behind your back. Push your hands down, open up the chest, drop the shoulders, squeeze your shoulder blades together. Breathe deep breaths and push those hands down and back. Okay, let's take it into a shoulder stretch. Bring one arm across the body and pull that arm in. Drop the shoulders down and reach across. Let's stretch those shoulders. So with most of my workouts on my YouTube channel and inside my app, I do include a cool down, but I know that there are some workouts out there on YouTube that don't include them. So this one's here for you to save like and keep on repeating whenever you need it. Switch arms, same on the other side. Okay, open up those legs a little bit wider into a little squat position here. Bring your hands onto your thighs as you squat down in a wide stance, push away in those legs, one side at a time, feeling the stretch in the hips, the groin, and start stretching through those adductors and legs. Okay, come to a standing position into a quad stretch. Stand and balance into a quad stretch. Of course, if you need to hold on to something, if you're near a wall or a chair, then that's fine. Otherwise, balance, stabilize in the standing leg, bring the knees together, and then ease those hips forwards into a quad stretch. and switch over to the other side, same thing. And I always like to use my few minutes of cool down as a real transition from enjoying my workout to moving on to whatever's next in my busy day, a chance to really feel good about spending time on myself, on my body, on my mind, and really focus on that presence, enjoy the sweat, 
dripping and uh, the activation through your whole body. Let's take it into the final 30 seconds into a forward fold, bend the knees however much you need, push the hips back, drop your fingers to the floor. As you breathe out, relax the head and the shoulders, elevate the hips if you wanna have more stretch in the hamstrings, whatever's right for you, just drop your body down to lower back, hamstrings. You can move side to side, pushing your hips back. Okay, and then slowly rolling it up. Okay, cool down complete. Thank you so much for joining me. Hopefully that's really useful for you. Make sure you give it a like so it's saved so you can come back and do this whenever you need it. Make sure you click subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.